Welcome, gente. What's up? It's a girl, Nikki Sparks, and welcome to my channel. So, on my previous skincare routine, I showed you guys all the products that I was using to clear my skin. My skin was horrible. I will insert a video somewhere on the screen so you could see how horrible my skin was, even though I was using a lot of acids and stuff like that. I'm gonna get into it just now. So I was using the Ordinary, like couple assets from the Ordinary and couple other products that are in my previous video. My skincare routine is definitely, definitely not for sensitive skin, well the one that I had wasn't for sensitive skin at all because my skin is not sensitive but I almost got it sensitive because it was too much acids that I was using at once and every day. I was aware that it wasn't okay, but since my skin wasn't so sensitive, got through the battle with me and we are here. So like I was saying, the previous video, like my skincare wasn't for, it's not for sensitive skin, but it can work if you space out the application. I invite you to go watch that video and then come here so you could see the big difference and how my skin has gotten so 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 much better so let me just jump right into it so you can see my skin under all this makeup and um, my first step of my skincare routine is that I remove my makeup so first I'm gonna remove these lashes Voila, my mirror is on that side. I can't film on that side So I'm gonna be facing you guys here while I watch here. I don't know. I'm gonna make it work Don't you worry. So first things first. I use this bomb 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 eye makeup remover from Maybelline I really really love it. It has a normal one the normal one. I don't like it. I like the one that removes waterproof makeup because it removes everything without without forcing too much you know you gotta go easy around the eyes we don't want no wrinkles so so first I remove my eye makeup I like to remove my eyebrows and my lips. Then what I just use is a face oil, a face oil to remove the rest of my makeup. And this oil is from the brand Belief. It's a Korean brand and it's a very good face oil. It contains macadamia seed oil. It's a cleansing agent, so this will help me double cleanse which double cleanse which means that it's cleansing first with the oil based cleanser and then i'm going to go in and wash my face with a cleanser with a regular cleanser so i just take one or two pumps and just that oh, let me remove this so i do this every day even if i'm not wearing any makeup Even if I'm not wearing any makeup, I double cleanse because it's good for your skin. And my skin loves, love, love these products because I don't break out. After I massage, after I massage all, all the makeup out of my skin, like for one minute. So I'm going to rinse this out and look at my face. I still have some dark spots on this side and a little bit on that side, but it's nothing as it was before. I'm going to insert some pictures and you will see how horrible it was. I started uh, my treatment in June. I started using Ordinary in June and by August my skin was clear and now it got even clearer and my face wash that i love so much this is my second bottle just as this the oil too the oil is my second bottle as well 
is a Korean brand and the name is Laneige. Laneige and it's a, it's a multi deep clean cleanser. So it's a deep cleanser, exfoliates, it has papaya enzyme, blueberry extract and I love it. So I take a very small like this because a little bit goes a long way. And make sure I massage everything. My skin feels so so soft. Before I always used to feel like little bumps beneath my skin that I couldn't get to. And now I don't feel anything. It's just soft as a baby's butt. Literally. <laughs> I'm going to rinse this out and I'll be right back. I just only use napkins to dry my skin. It's the best thing to dry your skin because it doesn't have any bacteria like your regular towel. Okay. The first thing I do is put my eye cream in the one I the one that I chose and the one that I like. This is my second my second jar because I really really like it and it does the job. Hyaluronic hyaluronic acid cream, a brightening eye cream. And it's from the brand Sephora. It looks like this. And it really do brighten the under eye. You know, you have to tap, tap, tap your under eye cream. I like to, I just do both. I just tap and smooth, tap and smooth. That's what works for me. As my toner, I'm, I'm using the glycolic acid 7% toning solution from The Ordinary. And a cotton pad. And I just rub it all over my face. Ooh, I'm so happy every time I see my the happy dance the happy dance the happy <laughs> every time I see my skin looks look like that I will just get so excited I will get so happy like the happy dance the happy dance cuz I really struggled to get my skin into this point and that it lasts because most of the time it would get cleared and two months after brrr, all these bumps are back and destroying my face and the baby of the night the baby of the skincare is this retin-a cream that i got from the pharmacy you need a prescription i spoke about it on my previous video as well so retin-a is good for acne scars acne um, is an anti-aging cream it's good for dry skin it's just the bomb all you need to do is be patient because at first your skin is gonna be like kind of acting up it can be acting up and thing but after two weeks you will see you will start seeing results like two three weeks after start using it this cream and this plus the ordinary made my skin like this like this oh my god I will insert again the picture so you could see that this is no bullshit this is real shit no bullshit this is how my skin is right now so I take a very small size like this And just a tiny bit on my forehead. I'm very grateful that I I managed to clear my skin and I'm very happy because clear skin is happiness. Clear skin to me is happiness because I can come out of my house with no makeup if I want to. I don't need to be, I don't have these bumps in my face 24 7 harassing my soul. And I can go anywhere with no makeup. And even with makeup, it's annoying because makeup can't hide the bumps. The bump might still be there. You know, it can just make, it can make you look more presentable, but the bump will still be there and to still look ugly so it was it used to harass me like really harass me it was annoying af 
to have bumps and I think everybody can relate to me nobody likes that nobody likes bumps nobody likes acne nobody likes it at all and that's it that's all I'm doing to my skin right now and I'm going to do a daytime skincare routine so like I said don't forget to click on the notification bell like and subscribe this video and if you are in love with the results as much as me smash the like button and subscribe thank you for watching see you on my next video bye Mwah.